In this video, we'll show you how you can combine and blend two photos using Canva. It's really easy, and this can be done in a couple of steps. We will first add the two photos which we want to use for our project on two different pages. Now we have to go over to the Elements section and search for Gradient. Select a white gradient and put it at the left or right side of your first photo. When you do place the gradient, you want to duplicate it two or three times until it looks something like this. And we then have to select the two or three layers of the gradient and group them together. Duplicate that and add the gradient group to the other photo. Just put the gradient in the opposite direction compared to the first photo. So in my first photo, the gradient was on the right side of the screen, so I will put it on the left side of my second photo. Once you apply the gradients to the two photos, you want to download the photos to your computer. Download them separately. So I'll first download my first photo, which is this man, and then I'll download the second photo of the city. Let's continue to the next step now. We have to upload the two photos, which we had just downloaded from Canva. And we will put both photos on the first page, and we can delete the other page, because we won't be needing it anymore. Add the first photo, and then add the second photo and make sure it fits the frame of our project. Now, select this Transparency option at the top and set this to around 50%. The two photos will look something like this, and you can make your adjustments and resize the photo even more if you need to. When you're happy with your photo, download it to your computer and upload it to Canva one more time. While it's uploading, we will delete the two photos from our page and then we'll add the photo which we had just uploaded. And the last step in this tutorial is to make some adjustments with our photo. Tap on this Edit Photo option, then Adjust, and we will decrease the brightness a little bit. We have to increase the contrast to 100% and we will also increase the saturation a little bit. You can make these three adjustments as you like, but just make sure that the contrast slider has a high level. When you do this, you can download your photo and enjoy. If you want more similar Canva tutorial videos, make sure to check out the playlist from the description down below, and I will see you in the next video.